¿En inglés o en español primero? I'm not sure. En inglés si quieres. En inglés. Hey guys, what's up? My name is William from Currents Motorsports. Uh, we're gonna do a little bit walk around around the Gladiator Demon. Gladiator Demon, yeah, that's correct. Uh, we're gonna talk a little bit about this project and the previous project that he had, uh, which is uh, the Blue Waffle. And we have a lot of things to say about it, but we can't really say a lot, which sucks, uh, yet, for now. Uh, so quick walk around about this, around this Jeep. It's a stock Gladiator. It's got a uh, stock everything except for the shocks that Terraflex hooked it up with. Why are you laughing, bro? I can't do this like this. So it's a 2019 uh, Jeep Gladiator Rubicon. It's completely stock, and that sucks. Except for this. Wait, that's not a that's not a V6. What? What is this? I'm just kidding. It's a demon motor. And it's, it's a little bit fast. Uh, so this swap was done by America's Most Wanted up in Michigan. Uh, Jared is the owner of the shop. Uh, really cool guy. And I introduced him to Eddie uh, back in the day, probably uh, I would like to say maybe a couple months, maybe almost a year ago. And Eddie was having issues with Blue Waffle uh, when it came to tuning and some durability issues that a lot of people know about it, like it's not a surprise. Uh, when you modify a car to that level, you might run into tuning issues or wiring issues. So there was a lot of hands that went on that vehicle and it caused a lot of issues. So, you know, I talked to Alisa from SP Tuners, which she's awesome by the way, and she recommended Jared for anything that's Hemi related. So we took it to him uh, up in Michigan. We met up with them. So he he fixed everything in Blue Waffle that was tuning related. Then we came back, we redid the suspension, and he took it to EGS and kicked ass. So Eddie decided that he needed more power. So he bought a Gladiator and then put a Demon motor. A Demon motor has 707 horsepower. Psych! That's the wrong number! <laughs> the Demon has more than 700. Oh, Eddie's calling me. Yo. Hey, quick question. How much horsepower does your demon have? 840 horsepower. I'm doing the YouTube video, so I'll call you later. Bye. So Eddie said it has 840 horsepower. That's the <laughs> he actually called me. That was no plan. That was just a funny uh funniest thing. Sorry. Funniest thing. Uh so it's got a demon motor. And that's pretty much it, man. That's all it really has. Uh they we're gonna become the installers for America's most wanted hemi swaps and we're excited to do something with them soon so hit us up if you want anything that is hemi related we got you and we're going to talk a little bit about the project so the project is going to be it's going to SEMA, and there's a lot of things that are going to happen sadly i cannot review everything right now uh, i could tell you it's a jeep and it's got a demon motor that's about it uh, and it's got falcon shocks thank you terraflex it has no hard top uh, Eddie had to sell it because he couldn't afford the motor. I'm just kidding. It's getting color match. <laughs> it's getting color match. It's gonna get a, a couple upgrades that I cannot say and I hate that. And I'm very excited, but it's gonna happen soon. So if you guys wanna see something cool, we could do a quick walk around uh, Blue Waffle and, and see if you like that Jeep, I guess. I like it. What is, what, what is there to like on a 6.4 motor that's built and it's got a supercharger, uh, a rift supercharger. So, quick, quick. I think everybody wants to hear the difference between the, this motor and that motor. I think that's a great idea. Wow, you're actually smart. Uh, do you want me to walk, talk about this Jeep or yeah, no? Okay, so it's a 2015 Jeep JKU uh, Rubicon. Uh, it had Dana 44s, 
When I met Eddie, okay, this is actually a funny story. When I met Eddie, Eddie had 22 by 14 inch wheels on 40 inch tires. Super wide. Like, wow. <laughs> so, I don't even know how he ended up going wheeling with us one day and he's like, oh, I'm hooked. And then he, psh, Dana 60s and everything. Just crazy guy, bro. Uh, quick, quick walk around. So, 6.4 uh, Hemi. It's got a, a stroker kit. It's built for boost. It's got a rip supercharger. It's got PSC goodies. It's got Genesis dual battery. Has a lot of custom stuff. Uh, from the batteries are relocated to the back. There's a custom transmission uh, cooler back there that went with the battery and went. So it never overheats. It doesn't ever heat ever. And that's awesome. Sweet. Uh, it's got a, it started as a Rebel off-road suspension, which is a really good suspension out of the box. Uh, but this Jeep need a little bit more. It, we wanted something a little bit more uh, different, more unique, I guess. Uh, so we went with, like, uh, you know, towers and we pretty much French the mounts. We outboarded the rear coilovers as well. Uh, it's got Spicer Dana 60s, Maxis 42s, Raceline wheels. Uh, this, it's got a Poison Spider roll cage, Poison Spider front bumper, rear bumper, motor build, fenders. So, you're hearing a lot of really high quality brands because that's what we use here. We, we, we're believers that there's a lot of great products out there and we like to represent all of those products that are really good. So if you're doubting about a certain brand, just give us a call. We'll make sure to you know, guide you in the best direction. Uh, so I'm, I'm kind of done, bro. Let's just, let's just get into these things. Yep. So 6.4, supercharged, rib supercharged, and Damn, son, where'd you find this? That's, that's how it sounds. You okay? <laughs> yeah. My bad, bro. And now, and now, uh, should I close the hood? Yeah, right. difference in the sound <laughs> they both sound badass and that's what really matters nobody really cares which one sounds better they both sound badass uh, and I think I think that's all we got for now sadly uh, we're gonna be doing more YouTube videos uh, more walk arounds with more information than just this uh, like I said this is still kind of top secret we're gonna be revealing the sponsors really soon we're gonna be releasing what we're gonna be doing to it and there's gonna be a few parts for sale out of that so stay tuned <laughs>